Say there is a known outbreak of measles in a community where you work. To guide a prompt response to the outbreak, you may need to track all the cases individually in a line list. A line list is used during disease outbreaks to record suspected cases individually. Line lists are most often needed to collect and report information about an outbreak to guide prompt outbreak control response. To use a line list, you will identify suspected cases of the disease, collect information about each case on your line list, and then use the information to report to higher levels as needed. To identify a reportable case, refer to the standard case definition of the vaccine preventable disease provided by your national authorities. Then, collect information about each case using the line list. The format of the line list may vary by disease and disease control activity requirements. This is a sample line list for measles. The unique case identification number is used to put cases in order and is not linked to the numbers on the immunization register or the AEFI cases in any way. On your line list, start with case 1, then case 2, and so on. Enter each case only once using a single case number. If a patient returns for a follow-up, you can update the original line for that case. Enter patient information including name, date of birth, sex, and vaccination status for that disease. Also include the caregiver's address and phone number if available. Enter possible sources of infection such as any contact with another infected person. If possible, include the case ID number. Add the date of the onset of symptoms and the date that the patient first presented at the health facility. Mark relevant symptoms using the standard case definition for this disease that is provided by national authorities. Record the date the lab specimen was taken and the results. Enter the outcome of disease in terms of recovery, recovery with sequelae, or mortality. Then classify the final diagnosis. How you report the information that you have collected in your line list will depend on your situation and procedures. Your line list may be used to monitor an ongoing situation and track the cases that will be added to your monthly tally of vaccine-preventable diseases. In some situations, you will need to report new cases immediately by phone for prompt outbreak control. As you have seen, Line lists can be a valuable tool for identifying, collecting, and reporting information about vaccine-preventable disease outbreaks in your community.